My name is Roan, I'm from Melbourne, Australia, and I've been working on this project, Empty. In the last few years I've been really fortunate to be flying around the world painting these huge, large-scale murals, but alongside that I've tried to do a few small walls locally around Melbourne in just back laneways and little alleys and doorways. It kind of made me fall in love again of just painting in the street just for the hell of painting it. It just it was so much more exciting and there's a lot less pressure compared to like when you do such a landmark mural where you've got a responsibility to do something that really reflects and connects with the community. Then this led me to wanting to paint more murals like this and smaller situational works and I started to find other spaces other than laneways which became like abandoned warehouses and abandoned houses where there's a sadness knowing that each space was once a company in place. People lived and worked within these walls and now they're on the brink of collapse. By painting each of these spaces I wanted to bring back that human element. Painting beautiful works in these places of neglect to try and highlight what may have been lost or perhaps what we are trying to hold on to. Every empty space poses the same question. What was there before there was nothing? And the story of each space is told through what's left behind. I started you know, trying to paint in these spaces and there's a lot of difficulties like the roof's falling in, the floor's falling away, you don't know what you can and can't step on and I'm trying to put together makeshift ladders or things to stand on and even painting on the walls they, they start to crumble as I'm putting paint on there. Everything this exhibition will be you know, gone in the next few months or few years either by them being destroyed or by them slowly rotting away in these houses. The exhibition space was originally a silent movie theatre. It was originally called the, the Star Lyric Theatre. It's kind of, you walk in there and you can see it's just a, a monumental building but it's just been reduced to a dollar store. Once I you know, got the opportunity to do something for its you know, last few weeks of its life, um, you know, I jumped at it and to have that, you know, these last moment you know, feeling and knowing that this is actually the last moment to fill this space and I, I think it's kind of a, a beautiful send off for the space and I'm kind of glad we get to you know, be within it for this last time.